What's up guys and thank you for choosing my pro my name is Chris and today I want to talk to you about Facebook graph search uh, Facebook graph search is basically uh, the Facebook search engine right here which is right here in the search bar uh, some sort of semantic search engine designed to give answers to almost natural language requests so the graph search is not like the, the normal search search bar in any other website uh, this search bar allows it gives it increases the depth of personalization and it gives you answers according to what you like the things you like the places you visited your friends and the things your friends like so I'll show you a couple of examples on how to use uh, Facebook graph search it can also be used as a shortcut to access things for example if I want to go to my photos I don't need to go to my profile of course these are the long way of going to my profile uh, then I'll click on my photos to access my photos but using Facebook graph search I can just come here and say my photos uh, hit enter and this should give me a list of all the photos in my Facebook profile there you go so those all those are my photos uh, Facebook graph search also allows you to look for things like uh, photos I like you can use the Facebook graph search almost in natural language photos I like so what you're doing you're requesting the photos you've liked on Facebook other people's photos who that you've liked so you can see the results there give you all the photos you've ever liked I can still go deeper with uh, Facebook graph search and more personal and get more personal for example you can look for somebody's photos by saying uh, photos of that uh, choose one of your contacts for example I choose Nancy and it's gonna suggest for me and I'll click there and it should list for me photos of my Facebook contact Nancy there you go so it's as simple as that go so further step and say photos of Nancy Uh, maybe photos of Nancy that have been liked by my other Facebook friend if I want somebody's photos that have been liked by somebody else I can say photos of Nancy liked by for example Morris there you go then I click that and it should give me for me only the photos of Nancy that Morris has liked so you can do this for very many searches it, it's basically uh, a social a social search engine uh, for example if you want to go to a restaurant and you want to know which is the best restaurant in your area or in Nairobi and you can look for restaurants in Nairobi uh, for example uh, I'll show you another example if I'm looking for restaurants in Nairobi so I can search Italian restaurants in Nairobi initially when I click that Nairobi Kenya and it can list for me all the restaurants in Nairobi Kenya there you go but then I can do a more personalized search uh, I can look for maybe restaurants that my friends have been to so I can still increase this search and say Italian restaurants in Nairobi Kenya uh, my friends have been to I've been to then I can hit enter and it should list for me only the restaurants that my friends have been to in Nairobi Kenya Italian restaurants for example it could, it's gonna give me two results then I should see this restaurant has been visited by one of my Facebook contacts John uh, this other restaurant has been visited by one of my face another of my Facebook contact that one so basically Facebook graph search is just gives you it increases the depth of personalization of the search results and the things you can search and it allows users to use almost natural language to uh, give queries to uh, the search engine thank you so much that's how to use Facebook graph search uh, Facebook graph, graph search is available in all Facebook accounts you can uh, just go to your Facebook and log in and start using graph search and uh, search places and things and people and restaurants and everything 
uh, thank you so much for watching you can ask any question you have in the comments below and don't forget to subscribe i'll see you guys soon